that is faithful. Be there for him. Don't use his weaknesses against him. Your husband is not perfect. For instance, he committed adultery three years ago. And then you wake up in the morning. Today is July 7th. <laughs> and your husband says, what's wrong? Why are you crying? Don't you remember today's date? It is the anniversary of your adultery. <laughs> you think I can forget? <laughs> there are some days I can't forget. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, is it because the woman sitting beside you has not told you her own story? Who doesn't have a story to tell? Cover him up. Forgive him. Here in the grace of God we all stand. Anybody can fall into adultery. The grace of God. I get married as a virgin. Thank God for you. But please don't use that to oppress anybody here. That's what oppress us. 2 Corinthians 5 17. If any man be in Christ, he's a new creature. All things are passed away. Behold, all things have become new. Honor your husband. Some of you, you serve your husband's meals as if he's a dog. But when guests come, ha, the mayor is here. That one is here. You serve. He, salad. Yeah. But the moment they go, you pack off the plates. You stack them. And you worship them every Saturday. Some people are coming to inherit those plates after the rapture. <laughs> Let them have feel important. My husband's cutlery is different. His glass cup is different. In fact, there was a time I made a throne for him. He's a king in that house. Let the man matter. Let him matter. And stop talking to him anyhow. Even when you are angry, don't be rude to your husband. That's the father of your children. And some of you women, you use sex as a weapon of punishment. The man wants to touch you. One man said anytime he wanted to make love to his wife, she would be spraying in tongues. He sent me a mail. That is not spirituality. It is religiosity. If there's any grammar like that. What? And then I don't understand you married women. This missionary style, I still don't understand it. <laughs> Only one style. Since you got married five years ago. And you are always underneath. When the Bible says that shall be above only. What? <laughs> After today, change address. Come up here. And you can make love anywhere. In the kitchen, in the ba- if a bathroom, or Kayabo Shantala. I need to close, I beg. Praise the Lord. 